All right. So uh, you guys have been far too, far too kind. Um, so if Gaddis's offense was ass, this is ass light. That's the okay. first thing for you, Dawson. All right. We've gone from ass to ass light. Slight, slight improvement. Slight improvement, as Rojo just showed you. 4.9 points per game. Um, I don't understand how you can be a head coach this fucking long. This many games on the sideline, and you don't have the common sense that a 10-year-old does playing Madden on how to execute the last two minutes of a fucking half or a game. I don't, I don't understand how you can have zero fucking strategy, Mario. Your job, put the kids that I've recruited, this stud roster that I've recruited, put them in the best position so they can succeed. You don't do that. The, the, the basic strategy of football 101 escapes you. You don't, you, th you throw it at the fucking window. I'm not gonna kneel, not, just you, th you throw it at the fucking window. The, 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 the look of just confusion between Dawson, your quarterback, your facial expression every single game when there's about 90 seconds left in the game or in the half, and you guys don't know what the fuck you're going to do. Do we kneel? Do we throw it? Do we run? Do we take a timeout? Do we not tie? It's fucking painful to watch, dude. Hasselback is sick of watching it. He's called like four games. He's like, I can't fucking do this shit anymore. I can't Why fucking do it anymore. Every call. I can't fucking do it. What are they fucking doing? My seven-year-old son learned this after an hour of Madden the fuck are you doing bro eight million a year how have you not gotten better at this this has been following you in your career from fiu to fucking oregon to here how have you not fucking taken an off season and understood this shit and gotten better at it utter incompetence complete incompetence. i have zero faith outside of recruiting zero faith for you to do fucking anything this roster has to be so fucking good, a la 2001, like Larry Coker, to overcome your ineptitude as a gay manager. That's what we need. A roster so fucking good, they can overcome your and Dawson's ineptitude. Have fun getting that on campus, bro. So that's where I'm at. Like, the roster's better, the team's better, but you are fucking literally, quite possibly, the worst game management coach I've ever seen in my entire fucking life. We're paying $8 million a year. To me, close to home, I'm not going to say the name, but I, I watched this this young player, right? It's, it's in volleyball. And for whatever reason, when the game comes on, looks great in practice, does great. But when she gets set, the timing is completely off. Like when the game lights are on, the timing, it's just not there. Like it's too inconsistent. And I think that's Mario at this point. You, you know what we said about Tyler? On again, off again, on again, this is who you are. When Mario has made bonehead game day decisions and he has a track record, that's who he is. So, me, uh, you're right, Toast. So, all of us, how the hell do we, what do you do moving forward? My only suggestion is, even though you are being paid $8 million a year, whoever's in that building needs to look in the mirror and say, I'm paying me $8 million to try to get a 2001 roster. Anything but a 2001 roster is a failure because that's what I'm good at. And now that I'm not good at this, I'm not good at, I don't have the timing. I don't have, when the game lights are on, I can't, I can't figure out to kneel. I can't figure out when to tag, take timeouts. I can't figure out when to go for it, when not to go for it. Then get somebody on the sidelines who can, right? That's what a CEO does. I can't do this anymore. I'm physically incapable. Toast, you made the compelling argument. It's followed you wherever you go. It's physically incapable so find somebody on the sidelines who can hire somebody just to make those decisions for you that's all they focus on because you're right he you know they keep men melding with each other tyler looks not confident right you could see his body language you can pick up on it it's very palpable mario looks lost Mario looks lost. He does. I mean, I, when, when Mario, in those situations, he's just got, this is his face. Ready? Right here. And that's, and, and that's what you get for a good 10 seconds. And I'm like, call a timeout. Neil, do something. <laughs> somebody, somebody hit Mario. He's stuck. And get somebody to, 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 to just change the narrative here. Because you're right, Toast. It's followed him everywhere he's went. Can you do me a favor? Bro, I need when you go back and you do student of the game, if you if you do it this week, 
Um, it's going to be later tonight because I... But at least look at it for me. I need to know the fourth down where where I'm tweeting incessantly, what are we doing here? The fourth and one? Yeah. yeah. What From are we shotgun? doing? What, shotgun? Why, are, why are we kicking this? Or why aren't we kicking this? Why mm-hmm. are we going for this? Our defense... I'm... I, Everyone says that I was that I was being uh, reactionary. No, if you looked at the tweets prior, I'm screaming from the rooftops. Don't go for this. Mm-hmm. They call a timeout, mm-hmm. and they came back in the same. And look. they came. I need to know if they were in the same personnel on the same set to run the same play. I do. I need to know this because you you <laughs> what'd you call a timeout for? <laughs> You, do you think you were going to get a different look from the defense if you ran out right. there with the same formation mm-hmm. to run the same play? No. Because that's the stuff that Toast is talking about. And that you 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 created, okay, fine, take time. I don't care. Take time. Get it right, dude. What do you have on your sheet for fourth and one? Well, and also with this offensive line, with the with with how much attention the tush push is getting with a quarterback that's what six three six four and 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 is built. Like, are you kidding me? You guys can't just do a quarterback sneak or something for a fucking yard. Like, you can't just like what the you go for shotgun. So you're throwing the ball five yards back. So now you got to get six yards instead of one. Like, what the fuck are you doing? You, yeah, you got typical these days, though. <laughs> You got to keep up with the offensive trends. And before Uh, everything was in a gun, everything was in a gun. I just think you do yourself a really huge disservice not coming under shotgun once in a while because those quick end arounds or like stuff like that that you could do under center, your back as a quarterback gets to the defense, your play action game picks up a little bit more. You know, there's things you could do. I mean, the Dolphins aren't, I, I keep referencing the Dolphins because they're the beautiful game right now. They're the beautiful game. They're the Brazilian counterpart, right? They're the Brazilian. It's the beautiful game. And what we're doing is not beautiful. I mean, think about this. All right, you start off in a bunch. You end up looking at it. Go on two. See if you could get the easy first down. If it's not there on two, shift open. Come under center and run a snap. So you would have had a two count, a shift, and then you go ahead and quarterback sneak this. That was an option. You just decided to stay in the bunch, give a long, elongated dive play with little guys to block big guys. It didn't work. You can Mike. Are we are we not able to do something like that though? I mean, just no. I'm not. I'm not. Well, but that's I'm what I'm saying. talking about. Scoop. That's what I'm saying. It's not creative. Oh, I know. And, and the the biggest argument I was getting: well, How can you be creative when your quarterback sucks? I'm like, listen, I'm not saying creative in terms of the passing concept. In terms of passing concepts, no, you're right. W- what do you want as far as passing games other than screens? Because he could see the field like in a two-foot box in front of him right now. I'm not talking about a downfield element needs to get creative. I'm not saying downfield. I'm just saying look across the way. Look at how they use Concepcion. Use Burchard Smith that way. Shift a little bit. And then when Mario said I was like, oh, look, he said it. He goes, we got to design it a little bit better for for things to come in the clearer view. We got to design. And I'm like, oh, that's just coaches speak. (laughs) I'm like, I've heard coaches speak. We've all heard coaches speak. When – when a part of the vocabulary in coaches speak to you say, we got to design it a little better, right? It's like, we have to coach it a little better, right? We have to, but I've never heard the specific term. We have to design it better. And I'm like, hmm, maybe he listens to us on our, on his lifts. I mean, Mario used to, I mean, Manny not used anymore. to listen to us. Yeah, not anymore. Nobody's listened to us anymore from that side of the, that side of the street. <laughs> <laughs>